Hi, I'm Peter Kalmstrom of Kalmstrom.com Business Solutions. In this demo I'll show you how to embed a YouTube video into your SharePoint site. First, of course, you need to go into edit mode of a SharePoint 2010 site like that. And you, there are similar steps for SharePoint 2007 also. But I want to show you this now. It looks deceptively simple. You go into HTML and edit the HTML source. And then you go into YouTube, of course, and you embed the video. You do that by clicking on the share button first and then the second click here embed. And since I'm doing this on an HTTPS site I need to click the HTTPS otherwise I'll get mixed uh, mode security warnings and stuff. Then I'll just go ahead and copy this copy, and then paste it in here. And That looks as if it's actually working. The video is you know playable there. But when I save and close this now it's gone. It's totally gone. There's no mention of that iframe in my HTML. So what I actually need to do to make this happen now is instead of just pasting the HTML there, let's go and edit, add a uh, web part called the content editor web part, which is found under insert web parts and more web parts there. And let's see, there we go. There comes the dialog for selecting a web part and I'm just going to do and select the there we go content editor web part and then I'm going to add that and of course that gets inserted exactly where I put the um, cursor and now to edit this I'm going to go into edit the web part and of course this uh, task pane shows up there and then I'm going to click here and then go into the format text and then HTML now since I've selected the content editor, this actually doesn't have any HTML source. And here I can go ahead and edit and just paste that iframe that I had before. Now I can save and close this. And here you go. Now this video actually plays within my SharePoint site. To make it a little bit more visually appealing, I will go ahead and actually edit this uh, toolbar here just remove the mention of content editor here because that's not the relevant information in this case uh, so I do that by going into appearance and then selecting chrome type none that will just show my video once I've saved and closed this page of course there we go now the YouTube video is embedded there Thank you for watching this demonstration. To make it a little bit more friendly and use um